I apologize to any of the judges if I serve them undercooked food. Uh, I'm very new to this, and there could be a situation. I don't have any, I need to cook my bacon and I have no pan. Now I'm looking at the other competitors and they're, they're, they're still cooking up. I just spilled uh, most of my onions on the ground. <laughs> I can't get it out. Welcome back to another episode of Kids Cook and today's challenge is to cook a gourmet burger. In a moment we're going to get you going but uh, just to explain what's going to happen you're going to have 30 minutes to do your preparation with the and you all have some common ingredients which includes uh, the beef mints, uh, we've got all kinds of sauces and condiments all going to use a brioche bun. Then what we're also going to do now guys is I want you each to reveal your special ingredients one by one okay so I'm going to go back over there and you're going to introduce your special ingredients what's going to make your burger very different. Hi my name is Sam and these are my special ingredients. First we have white wine vinegar, next we have Worcestershire sauce, then we have garlic powder, we also have paprika, Truffle oil, getting fancy. Onion powder, chili powder, and butter. And those are my special ingredients. Hi, I'm Oliver, and I'm from Springfield, Illinois. And uh, I don't have too many ingredients as Sam does, but uh, I have some white mushrooms. And then I also have some balsamic vinegar and I am also using some onions for caramelized onions and uh, some Swiss cheese for a nice cheeseburger. I'm Mason and I got barbecue sauce and Rob's Rock and Rib Rub. Are you done? Yeah. Okay guys, so you have precisely 30 minutes to start your preparation. Three. Two, one, let's cook! flavors are going to put me above the other contestants. Now what I want to make with my onions is um, to create a caramelized onions which will bring in the flavor of the burger and really just make that oomph come in. I think my burger is very special because it's a classic barbecue, nothing much to it, just king of the barbecue. Uh, there's no pans left. Did you pour olive oil in there? I need a pan. Nope, there's it's no bacon pan. grease. I don't have any, I need to cook my bacon, there's no pan. It's going pretty good. Uh, I just spilled my onions all over the place, but I th I'm cutting some more up and putting in. But the grill is not very hot, so I switched them over to the stove, and that's working a lot better. So I'm feeling pretty confident, but I think, I don't know. I think it's going to go pretty good. I need to really quickly cook all my stuff and it's annoying that I made that mistake of um, not cooking up my mushrooms with my onions because now it's put me behind schedule a little bit but I can still you know get through. Okay guys so you literally have two minutes more of prep and then we're gonna start cooking the burgers. Just two more minutes okay and then that's it prep's over and you've got to start cooking burgers. So no burgers go on the grill until, Sam, until two minutes is up, okay? Now I'm looking at the other competitors and they're, they're, they're still cooking up. I'm, I, my burgers are done. I'm, just, I'm thinking about presentation now. The presentation's gonna be good.
All right, guys, okay, so that's it now. Prep is over, start cooking your burgers, please. I apologize to any of the judges if I serve them undercooked food. Uh, I'm very new to this, and there could be a situation. And I'll deal with it if there is, but I'm hoping it's cooked through. Okay. Sam, tell us about your sauce. Uh, my sauce is a um, special sauce. And it has uh, mayonnaise, ketchup, garlic powder, paprika, onion powder, white wine vinegar, Worcestershire sauce, it has truffle oil. It has a lot in it that make the flavors just, just, it's a party in your mouth. Okay, so it's a pretty simple sauce. Uh, it's one of my favorite sauces to make. It's just a mix of mayonnaise and ketchup, and then I'm gonna add maybe just a tiny bit of sugar to bring the sweeten, sweeten it in. I just, you always gotta taste what you're gonna eat before you eat it, and it's very delicious because it just, it brings all together that sweet and juicy flavor. Okay, so as we near the, uh, the end of this competition, the boys are just finishing off their cook on the burgers. I'm gonna introduce the judges for today's uh, cook-off. And remember that the judges are gonna be eating blind, so they're not gonna know which of the boys' uh, burgers they're tasting, and they're gonna cast their votes after they've eaten. So first up is uh, Mrs. Angela Crocker. Please come and join me. Thank you so much for having me. Of course, Stu. absolutely. So what is it that uh, you're looking for uh, from uh, your burger today? Sure, that's a great question. A burger is a real, can be a really complex, wonderful lunch, dinner, snack even. Uh, I really like it to be juicy. Juicy is really important to me. A dry burger is no bueno. And so some good flavor as well. I mean, that's really a bonus. Perfect, that sounds awesome. Uh, I want to next bring in uh, Mrs. Beebe. Please come on in. Uh, welcome to the uh, the judging Hello, panel. Uh, so tell me, what is it that you're looking for uh, from for your burger today? Uh, well, uh, a sort of a medium done burger that's not too dry, so juicy, and I'm interested to see what they're going to put with it in terms of accompaniments and how those blend well with the burger. Nothing too spicy, but that's just my preference. Very good. Okay. Well, I'm looking forward to uh, the taste as well. So, uh, if you want to step over here, thank you very much. Okay. okay so, uh, Mr. Crocker is our third and final judge. Hi, uh, Mr. How Crocker, are you? how are you doing? I'm doing well, thank you. Uh, so, tell me, what is it that you're looking for out of a great burger today? I, I just do not want the burger to move back at me. You know, I want it cooked. <laughs> uh, besides that, I want something unique. I want a kick to it. Juicy explosion in your mouth. I don't know. Yeah, something. Okay, well, in a moment we're going to go over and we're going to taste these uh, these wonderful burgers that the boys have worked very hard on. So, uh, are we ready for it? I'm ready. Let's go. All right. Okay, guys, so we have uh, literally two minutes to go. I hope your burgers are done because we have our very special judges going to be coming to uh, taste your burgers any minute now. So, um, uh, Sam, last few words from you. Anything? Um, team flavor coming in for the win, hopefully. Oh. Nice. Uh, Oliver, anything last words from you? Um, I think that my cheese is cooking well. It's starting to melt off, so uh, I think that's a good sign. Good. And then finally, Mason, anything, any I, last words I from had you? a little bit of nerves. They're all gone now. I think mine's the best. Okay, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Hands in the air. Hands in the air. Okay, good. Well done, everybody. Well done. Right. Okay, boys. Uh, listen, uh, great job today. Well done. Um, I think you've done a great job. Uh, we're now going to bring in the very prestigious judges to taste your dishes. They will be tasting blind. Uh, so I want to wish you all the very best of luck. But whoever wins, have you enjoyed it? Yeah. Yes. It's all, yeah, been, yeah, about, yeah. It's all been about fun, right? So, uh, again, well done. Great competition. It's been fun to see. So if you go and take your seats over there, and we'll announce the winner after we got the judges in. Okay, so uh, we're now going to bring the judges in t for this uh, very prestigious tasting of these mighty fine burgers in front of us. Drum roll. Okay, Andrew, so um, I want you to, uh, to rate these in, in order. Um, you know, one, two, and three, please. So uh, if you could make a start there. This is very difficult. I mean, <laughs> well done, boys. I mean, well done. These are top-notch burgers. That's a very difficult task, so I'm gonna have to go one, 
two, three. Okay, one, two, three. Okay, yep. thank you very much. Okay, okay uh, Wendy, please come on in. Um, please tell me about the uh, what you thought and the, and the results. So I am going to say one, two, three. All right, so we're pretty even right now. Uh, so, uh, Angela, any comments uh, before you make your final judgment? Um, fellow judges have already said how well cooked. And the one thing I had said coming into this was the the uh, how you know a juicy burger is so important, and they were all they all hit the mark there. Awesome. And I'm going to go one, uh, and then two, and then three. <laughs> okay. Thank you very much. Uh, again, this has all been a fun competition. I hope you've enjoyed it. So it's really not about the winning; it's just yes. really about the enjoyment. So, um, Oliver, I'd like to declare you today's winner. So, good job. Okay. Uh, and Mason and Sam, terrific runners up. So again, commend you both. So uh, awesome job, everybody. So uh, that brings us to the end of today's uh, Kids Cook Off. I hope you've enjoyed it. Remember to subscribe to our channels. I think we've all got YouTube channels, so this has got on every one of them. So remember to subscribe to the channels. Thanks ever so much for watching and see you next time. Wait, so we get to eat our burgers yeah, now? Please. Yeah, please. Good great. job. I just don't like, I don't I like as much say. barbecue mm. with that. It's really, really good. Unbelievable. The bacon, you should do that at home. They the were all awesome. Sam, Sam really well. lost. And oh. I like that you did that. Wow, I did. That's great. I love them. You were always you like, oh, I'm going to win. Yeah, that was yeah, pretty you good. Know what? Yeah. My burger's better than yours. Yeah, that was good. I think I've never had a barbecue burger. That was such a Yeah, the barbecue adds a nice little kicker.